Hi guys, I have my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus for May. I'm gonna be unboxing it, so if you're interested in seeing what came in that box today, keep watching the video. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and also comment down below. Now, let's get started with this video. As you can see, if you watch my videos regularly, I usually film in my bedroom. I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't have like a ring light, so I always tend to film my videos during the day when it's sunny or when it's really bright outside. And today, I just feel like I need to do it now or I'll never do it because I'm a very bad procrastinator. And so yeah, I'm just going to review this stuff today, even if it's in my bathroom. Um, I'm sorry about the lighting, it's not as bright as it usually is. I know all these bulbs above my head, they're like really, really hot and I'm really, really, really burning up, especially because I'm wearing a long sleeve shirt. Anyways, let's get into this box. I actually received this box about a week ago. So this is why I decided to do my video right now. I have so many things to do during the day. Today's my hubby's birthday. I'll just like fade away into space and like start looking at stuff online or like watching other YouTube videos or like, I don't know. I would, I would just do everything else except for the video. So here it is. Let's get started with the first product. So this month it came with this little brochure, pamphlet, whatever you want to call it. It says, get that glow. I guess that's the theme, get that glow. It does not say how much each product is. It doesn't even tell you the name of the product. So I'm just gonna do my best and um, describe the products. Also, side note, I've tried to film this video a couple times this week, but I was just not feeling it. So some of these products I've already used, I've already swatched, um, but I'm doing them again for you guys today in this video. So, all my other reviews of my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus uh, bags, I always tend to forget to show you the bag that they provide with this Glam Bag Plus. I always tend to forget to show it. So, here it is. This is what it looks like. And it has a little tassel. It's kind of oddly shaped, but it's kind of cute. And it's like, leather or pleather, whatever you want to call it. And inside of the bag, it looks like there's confetti in there or something, but it's cute. I like this bag. So yeah, that's the clam bag. The first product I want to show you guys is by the brand Beauty For Real. And I've had a couple of products from their brand here on some of these Ipsy Glam Bag Plus bags and I've actually been okay with them. So this brand is a cruelty freight brand and this product is their mascara. It's called High Def and it's in the color Just Black and it comes in this package and it's, um, um, I'm gonna show you what it looks like. This is what it looks like. The brush is like very, very tiny, but I guess I can use it because I have very long bottom lashes, so this would go really great for my long bottom lashes. This is by the brand Beauty For Real. So the next product is by um, Mud Masky, and it's an after mask vitamin serum, and it's pH balanced. It says it's for extra smoothing, anti-aging, feeding, protecting, and nourishing. I've already tried using this the past week, and I love the way that it feels on my skin because it's kind of like a watery. Here, I'll show you. The consistency is pretty clear. It doesn't have any smells or anything. And um, it's watery once you apply it. But once it dries off, it kind of dries off very um, smooth and velvety. It's really, really nice. And it feels very refreshing and it does feel like my skin is being nourished. And um, like it says here, it's feeding my skin so I can actually feel that. The next product I'm gonna show you guys is the third product. And that is the Tartiest Lip Paint by Tarte. And it comes in this package right here. This is the color. It actually looks a little maroonish on camera, but it really isn't. It's very dark and it's very, very brown. The thing I do like about this is that it's very smooth and velvety. Like the consistency is very velvety and it doesn't like completely dry up. 
I'm gonna swatch this product for you so that you can see the consistency of the product. So here, before I open it, this is how it looks. Um, I'm gonna try it right here. Let's try it right here. It's very pigmented. Very pigmented. It actually looks chocolatey brown in person. It looks like chocolate was just smeared on my wrist. And honestly, I'm really not a fan of dark, dark, dark colors. This is really not a spring or summer color for me, so I will not be using this color. All right, so the next product that I have is called Mimosa Moment Eyeshadow Palette. And it looks like this. This is the packaging. And this is a vegan, cruelty-free, paraben-free, gluten-free eyeshadow palette. So let's see what it looks like, and I'm gonna do some swatches for you guys see what the colors are actually looking like. So it comes in this cute little um, eyeshadow palette. So this is what the eyeshadow palette looks like. Um, you have all these colors here. Um, they look pretty neutral, very earthy. Uh, you got a rose gold here, um, a golden one here. Um, and honestly, this box doesn't come with the names or neither does the palette. It doesn't specify which of these is what what color but let me swatch them for you I'm gonna start with the lightest which is this one here and I'm gonna show you on my wrist what that looks like it's pretty chalky let me do it again that one is really chalky and very very sheer um, Maybe in darker complexions it'll like show up a little bit more because my complexion here on my wrist is pretty pretty fair. Um, but yeah, the consistency of this one is very chalky and it's kind of very transparent. Let's move on to the next color which is this golden color. Um, I'm going to swatch that one for you and I can already tell this one's going to be very pigmented because I just felt it and it really is it really is I don't know if you can tell let me see if I can make it focus so you can see the actual color there you go you can see the actual color there I like it a lot I thought it was gonna be golden but yeah let's move on to the next one and this one is very chalky as well, like the first one, um, but very pigmented. Wow, that's very pretty. Let's see if I can get it to focus there. It's very pretty, actually. I really like it. I'm excited for this color here because I'm very into earthy colors, neutral, um, and like brown nudes and all that those are my favorite favorite colors let's try that one and see how that one looks okay so we're gonna swatch here wow I really like that color okay let's move on to this one here this palette, I mean, this color here doesn't have a name like all the rest. This color here is more like a toasty um, rose gold, like um, kind of like a copperish color. I'm going to try it now and I'm going to swatch it for you guys. Oh, these shimmery colors are very pigmented. This one and this one. Just swatch. Oh my. I absolutely love it. This is beautiful. So pretty. These colors are the best. I'm not expecting anything from this color because this is just a regular brown and I'm um, dark dark browns are not like my best friends, but let's try it. Wow, oh my gosh. 
gosh. <laughs> that one is very pigmented as well. As you guys can see, there's a little bit of residue. The product does stay if you like swatch really hard like I did. But, I mean, it's really good. It's really good quality. I like all the colors. They all seem like they will blend all together and they're blendable colors. So, I'm excited to use this palette. And this palette again is by Colored Rain. I've never heard of them, but it seems like they have really good products. All right, so this is the last product, and this was my pick for the month, and I'm excited to show you this. I got to pick this highlight palette, and it looks like this, and it's by the brand Nomad, and I guess it's like an Ipsy special edition. Um, I'm really excited because the colors here are uh, these here, as you can see. Let's open this person, I mean, <laughs> But let's open her up and let's see what the colors look like. It kind of looks like a book. It's kind of interesting. If you see, if you like look at it, it all looks like a book, but it's so pretty. You have three shimmers, uh, three different shades and a matte color here. Um, I'm guessing this is like your bronzer and these are your highlights, but they're very pretty. I like the design. It looks like um, little suns. Let's try them out. So the first one I want to try out is the Balmoral Beach and that one is the lightest one. So let's try that one out. Um, I'm going to try it out right here again. Wow. That is super pigmented. I'm not sure how this will look once I try to use it as a highlighter. So that was Balmoral Beach. The next one is called Tamarama Beach and that is this guy here. So let's check him or her out. And let's do the swatch right here. It's very pretty. They're definitely pigmented highlighters, which I'm really liking. The next one we have here is Bondi Beach. So I'm going to swatch that one and then we'll go into the other one. Okay, so Bondi Beach. Wow, this kind of reminds me of the little palette we just swatched. Maybe I should have picked something different. <laughs> but yeah, these colors are very, very, very pigmented, which I'm very, very, very happy about. Let's go to the matte color. Let's just wipe my fingers. So now let's swatch the last color, which is called Manly Beach. This one's definitely a matte color, no shimmer, and very, very soft. Okay, definitely a bronzer. Not as pigmented as I thought, but it's pretty, it's a pretty color. And that is the Nomad Cosmetics Sydney, uh, the Ipsy edition. That was my pick for the month. Those were all the products guys, and I hope that you guys enjoyed me and the swatching and watching the video and seeing the products. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to comment down below. Leave me a comment, whatever you want, and um, I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye!